Can inverts be similar to humans? And out of all of them, ants? There are many ways these eusocial insects are like us. And one common aspect of our lives involves graveyards. Ants are fascinating. Not only are they known for forming colonies, but they are also extremely meticulous and clean creatures. There are around 15,000 ant species, all of which make incredible nests. Be it the arboreal fortresses of weaver ants or the mounds of fire ants, all nests have a complex network of chambers. Everything is segregated to maintain hygiene. Death is a natural part of life. Worker ants have a short lifespan and could also be killed or infected by parasites. The decomposition of the dead could endanger the whole colony if the bodies are kept within the nests and hence they are carried far away into the graveyard site. Here, there are piles of the dead and sometimes alive ants. As mentioned, ants are very particular about what stays in their nest. Unlike humans though, they do not mourn. Now, how do they sense the death of another worker? When an ant dies, it releases oleic acid, a chemical which signals other workers to pick it up and place it into the graveyard. The antennae pick up the scent and then they dispose of the dead one. That concludes this episode of Inverts for Dummies. If you learned something new, consider subscribing so as to not miss new episodes. This is ABSE signing out. Take care and goodbye.